All right, my name is Mike Swanson. We're here in Chamonix, France, and we are raging. Yeah, no, I jump out of helicopters or glaciers pretty much every day. It's part of my job. No, that never happens. I think it was Matt Gerz's idea. He said, this would be really fun to do. Let's go create our own little drop zone in the backcountry. I do love base jumping. I do love flying wingsuits in the big mountains. And I love skydiving with friends. So the idea was to create a backcountry drop zone. Well, uh, to make a drop zone, you, uh, you pretty much need a few things. You need an aircraft, you need some packing tools, a tarp, a bunch of parachutes and a bunch of people. You mix it all together and you got yourself a backcountry drop zone. Then you get to fly in the most incredible helicopter to this glacier over here, Lahong Glacier, Le Show Glacier. To be able to get in it and run laps in a helicopter, like in a valley with your friends, I, I can't even describe like, to do what we normally do in the sky and then take it and put two giant ass non-man-made objects and do it in the middle of that just makes me smile. Smiles and the, like energy buzzing off everyone was a thing to believe. Eh? So like we were up there on the best drop zone in the world. Everyone was sessioning and having a bunch of fun. The day was phenomenal. Eh? Like best weather, good pilot, smooth flow. It was just like a drop zone day from heaven. So yeah, I mean we decided to create this uh, a beautiful little moment deep in the mountains in the Massif de Mont Blanc, and it was beautiful. The landscape out there, the mountains, massive mountains, uh, this killer glacier, and then we've got this little blue tarp spot on the ground where you can kind of see people, and we're jumping out and we're able to fly a line kind of towards the mountains and banana around, just nice mellow flights, nothing, you know, too spectacular, just just fun flying. Nothing too spectacular. It was just the raddest place on earth to yeah. jump. <laughs> to get to see the mountains above my friends while I'm carving around on my head was insane. I don't think there's any other way to to describe that view. To have that perspective of what you're doing, it definitely makes you realize how fast you're going. The the distance you're covering, the size of everything around you is is incredible. I guess the goal for the whole trip was to find a totally out of this world location that uh, that's never been really flown before and see what we can do. The team was amazing. I mean, having so much experience there and so much talent and so much ability was really reassuring and took something that could have been intensely stressful and it just made it super fun. Having Rock Malnui as a friend and a contact here in Chamonix is invaluable for organizing stuff like this and then being able to put five guys in a helicopter, drop out. 15,000 feet in some pretty hostile mountain terrain and not have to really worry about them was really special. When everybody landed safe at the end of the day, it was a pretty intense feeling. So yeah, we're gonna open up an actual drop zone on the glacier. Jump tickets might be a little pricey, but I think people will find it's worth